Stadium lights are such a simple thing. As darkness descends, the lights go on, illuminating the action as we gather together, sing the national anthem and the school song, and cheer loudly for our hometown teams. But without the light, everything changes. In a spring that never seemed to have a chance, the games and the community celebrations were stopped by an ugly, dangerous virus that shut down schools, business, and sports on all levels. In the darkest of times, however, Minnesotans always stick together. And this time, the lights came back on and inspired us all, even in the midst of darkness, sadness, and uncertainty. All it took was a simple social media hashtag, be the light MN. Now a hashtag, of course, can't do great things all by itself. In the spring of 2020, folks all over Minnesota came together in the spirit of Be The Light MN, a spirit of hope, optimism, and love. Stadium lights stood tall and bright, a beacon for all the students who were doing schoolwork from home, all the teachers who were doing their jobs remotely, all the coaches who were absent from their athletes' lives, and all the families and community members who wanted so desperately to find some semblance of normalcy. From East Grand Forks to Duluth, from Minneota to Lanesboro, from Circle Pines to Thief River Falls, the lights shone brightly, briefly, over fields of play. Football and lacrosse stadiums, baseball and softball diamonds, tennis courts, running tracks. Schools that don't have lights at their fields turned on the lights inside empty gymnasiums, Everyone took the same path, following the light to a better day. The fields, diamonds, and courts were empty of humans, but filled with the best of humanity. The bright lights were a beacon, drawing long lines of cars illuminated by bright headlights, headed to green fields shining in the darkness. In some communities, the vehicles of first responders circled the fields with lights silently flashing, as tears flowed. The tears represented what was lost, but also what we all knew would return. Our towns, our teams, our kids, our communities. As Minnesotans, we have learned to never fear the darkness. We are all in this together, and we will always be the light.